Good day everyone, my name is Renan Netabio and we are Group 3. We are going to discuss the Module 5 about Digital Technology and Social Change. So, can you imagine yourself without cell phone or any gadget and internet today? Of course not, because most of us depend on phones, gadgets, and internet. If we do not access so social media, um, we feel like we are not updated enough to those latest news and happenings in the world. Digital age, also known as information age. It is a period when the computer and the internet were introduced. These technologies enable people to communicate information easily and rapidly. Digital technology became prevalent and widely used around the world. Information can be accessed easily, especially with the use of internet. Health chores and jobs are getting automated with the help of machines and equipment. Mobile phones became very useful in every areas in life and education, entertainment, jobs, and etc. Digital technologies have radically changed the way people work, consume, and communicate over a short period of time. Because of the internet, our lives became more convenient and with just one click, we can communicate people all over the world. The ICT and its role in social change. For us to understand the role of ICT in social change, let us first define the ICT. So, ICT stands for Information, Communication, Technology or Technologies. Um, it has the power to transform society. ICT defined as a group of interrelated technologies or electronic devices for accessing, processing, and disseminating information. ICTs are indisputably important part of our social setting today. The term ICTs has been used to embrace technological innovation and Merging in information and communication, transforming our world into information or knowledge societies. The rapid development of these technologies has painted the boundaries between information, communication, and various types of media. Information and communication technologies, um, or ICTs, significantly impact society's development by by facilitating access to information and knowledge, especially for marginalized communities. However, the current global information outburst has little impact on rural communities and developing workers. I see this transform many life, work, learning, and communication offering diverse social and economic benefits. They also enable financial inclusion through e-commerce and instant communication with millions. Social change involves the continuous transformation of culture and organizations in a modern world. The increasing use of ICTs depends on decisions made by organizations and individuals with economic leverage, political power, or technical expertise. Understanding their basis features is crucial to increase the consent potential of ICBs. I know that most of us are well aware that change is inevitable. That change is the only constant thing in this world. And ICT has drastically caused social change in our society. Because of ICT, Cultures and social organizations have transformed over time. ICT has impacted many sectors of our society and all of that will be discussed by the next reporters. But first, let us discuss the entertainment sector. Entertainment. With the advent of technologies, the world of entertainment is constantly involving. 
Digital broadcasting has completely changed the way we experience television and radio. Cinema can now be found at the comfort of your home through applications such as Netflix, iFlix, etc. We can get entertained by the content that we see in Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram. Computer gaming has also been an important influence in the development of graphical interfaces. Technology has been the forefront of changes in production and distribution of music. We can now listen to music and podcasts using Spotify. These are some of many technologies we use for entertainment that arise in the digital age. The impact of ICT on business is particularly significant. It empowers people to share knowledge and advice instantaneously and set up an online shop or website at a low cost, dramatically lowering the bars to starting a business as such ICT maturity is closely linked to economic growth. Businesses in today's life have promoted a lot with the coming of ICT. Its impact cannot be overemphasized. For example, ICT helps to increase productivity in business with the use of social media platform has been the marketplace where people can transfer and communicate. The impact of ICT and structure on social businesses cannot be understated. It has made social impact affordable, social impact scalable, and enables new ways to connect and engage with local communities. The impact of ICT on teachers, trainers, learners, researchers, and the entire education society is tremendous. It is changing the way of the education delivery system in the world by enhancing access to information for all. It also ensures effective and in inclusive education. ICT supports the concept of open learning where the trust is upon enhanced student access and the development of student autonomy. Educational technology makes the teaching process scientific objective, clear, simple, easy, interesting, and effective education in ICT gives proper guidance to solve teaching problems. Greetings everyone, and today I will discuss a job and earnings. A job is a formal arrangement where individuals provide their skill, time, and labor in exchange for compensation from employer. Earning refers to the money or income received from one job, which can vary widely depending on factors choose as job type experience, education, and location, earning a crucial for covering Living expenses, saving and achieving financial goals, job certification, and career growth also play significant roles in person overall well-being and financial. Digital transformation has significant impacts on human well-being, as it can lead to significant change in the labor market, composition, jobs that require specific skill set may be replaced by technology. Technology in higher skilled labor are completely automated, whether this digitalization also creates employment and new and existing industry with greater job-to-job -job ability. Facilitated by online job search tool, the digital economy fundamental changed the nature of work with every physical demands and more emotional strength on desk worker. Despite fears or automation, there is little evidence that technological change has led to a net loss of job, whereby some authors agree that ICT-based technological change will be more profound. Automotion is transforming various industries, including food preparation, cleaning labor, manufacturing, manufacturing, transport, and assembly, with some jobs being replaced by machines. Worker experts have been cautioned in the predicting the exact types of tasks that machines may perform. Recent estimates suggest that 
food preparation assistant, cleaner, helpers, laboratories in mill construction, manufacturing, and transport are most likely to be automotive. One technique teaching professional help, professionalism, and personal care worker always like to lose their job. Tolo working with all those people to work from home. May also provide work-life balance by improving time management and reducing community time. ICT are influencing employment both as industry that creates job and as I'm told that empowers workers to access new forms of work in new and more flexible ways. Earning from employment means girls with salary, tips, commission, and net income from self-employment. Earning from employment does not include income to implement benefits, social security, worker compensation, and basement income divided by wage received from city employment paid to Having a job and earning money are part of everyday life for most people, especially adults. The concept seems fairly straightforward. One works to earn this volume, discern the difference between a job and a career, as well as how job can develop into a career leaders or learn how the community economy needs job, how paying someone to do a job help the person who is paying them, and even about the job blues and is given that text also explains different job and their effects on the economic just at those of professional production arts and government and military jobs. Hello everyone, I'm Carl Joseph Yogbinada. So I will discuss to you how health is connected or related to ICT. Digitalization possesses health risks including mental health issues in children and teenagers and disrupts physical exercises. It also impacts healthcare delivery through electronic records, treatment options, telecare and teleconsultations. Digitalization also enhances health system efficiency through medical data productions. Digital innovations challenge traditional care providers' rules, impacting interactions and health inequalities. High data protection and security standards are crucial for the exchange of use of medical and health data. Online time among children and teenagers has increased by 40 minutes between 2012 and 2015 with iGeneration members checking social media accounts every 15 minutes. Smartphones have extended this risk to various applications. With 39% of 18 to 19 years old online almost constantly. Internet addiction triggers neurological processes similar to addictive substances releasing dopamine, opiates, and other neurochemicals in brain's reward center. Over time, receptors can deteriorate, requiring more stimulation. Children and teenagers are more susceptible due to their developing brains, as in a study in Belgium. A study on 3,000 Singaporean children found a bidirectional link between extreme internet and use mental health issues like depression, anxiety, social phobia, attention deficit disorder, anxiety often occurring together. Good morning everyone. We will tackle about the technology called determinism. Technological determinism is a reductionist theory that assumes that a society, technology, progress by following its own internal logical efficiency will determine the development of the social structures and cultural values. Hello. Next, we will tackle about the social contractivism. Social contractivism focuses on the collaborative nature of learning, knowledge, development from how people interact with each other. Their cultures and society are large. Students rely on others to help create their building blocks, and learning from others helps them construct their own knowledge and reality. Technological change. Technological change refers to the advancement of technical knowledge in capital and machinery production, enhancing labor and capital productivity through skill creation, new production methods, and machinery usage. Technological change is a powerful tool for gaining power from nature and strengthening human facilities. It involves sociological change modifying social, political, and administrative institutions to adapt to new production techniques and economic activity. According to J.P. Dewhurst, technology involves changes in material and human skills production processes. 
Technological advancements create new production techniques and goods, enabling the growth of new techniques that can produce goods and services at lower production cost. The process of growth of technical knowledge can be divided into the following stages. The first stage is the advancement in scientific knowledge. The second is that of the application of this knowledge to some useful purposes. And third is the commercialization of invention, which is called innovation. This has a great significance in the process of development. Sean Peter has distinguished between invention and innovation. Invention implies the discovery of new technique while innovation is practical application of invention in production for market. You may refer to it as commercialization that results from scientific development. While innovation is an economic fact, invention is a scientific fact. Large capital investments are made by the inventors at every stage of the invention process because it requires not only a scientific attitude but also a community-minded attitude and high-caliber entrepreneurial skills with the capacity to comprehend the potential of using scientific incentives for commercial purposes.